Hello, I'm Brock the Pirate, and welcome to my political compass test. Yes, welcome to my vid. I don't know. I haven't taken this test in a long time, like before. I, I know that it's biased towards being left, center left, which I was before, so. I don't know. I don't know. I I'm, I'm, thought I might make an interesting video. Testing my politics again. Alright. Proposition double. Killing the less hasty the country in the world. Its economic globalization is inevitable. Primarily serve humanity rather than interests of transnational corporations. I don't know. Transnational corporations. Serve humanity. Oh, I don't know. That's a tough question. I'm gonna say... I'm capitalist, but... Yeah, I agree. Always support my country, whether it was right or wrong. Suppose... I disagree. I have to say, I disagree. I mean, I don't know. Support depends on what. Nah, I strongly disagree. Like, when they're wrong, they're wrong. I mean, it's kind of dumb. <laughs> Why would you? No one chooses their country birth, so as well as you be proud of it. Strongly disagree. You should be proud of your country. I mean, they're your people. Our race has many superior qualities compared to other races. Well, I'm Filipino, so... Compared with other races... Yeah, we're hard-working, we kind people. Filipino, being Filipino, being Australian. In Filipino Australian um Yes, every all races all have superior qualities. Enemy of my enemy is my friend. Enemy of my enemy is my friend. Nah. Due to accident that defies international law is sometimes justified. Uh, international law. Nah. Now a worrying fusion of information and entertainment. Information and entertainment. What's wrong with information and entertainment being... Hmm. Spurs. A worrying fusion of information and entertainment. What is it? Information and entertainment. I don't know. Information is entertainment, though. I didn't understand. People are divided more by class than by nationality. Disagree, definitely. Ultimately divided more by class. No. Divided more by class. Controlling inflation is more important than controlling unemployment. Well, inflation controls unemployment, doesn't it? I mean, yeah, I'd have to strongly agree. Because corporations 
and controlling unemployment. Because like it leads to unemployment. I don't know. Because corporations cannot be trusted voluntarily protect the environment. They require regulation. Yeah, I'd have to agree. Like, corporations, and corporations in general need regulation. Like, I'm, I'm capitalist, but I don't know you. If there's no profit in it, they're not going to do it. <laughs> so I'm guessing they require regulation. From each economy's ability, each economy's need is... Each according to his need is fundamentally a good idea, yes. According to his ability, each according to his need. The free of the market, the free of the people. Yeah, free market. Unless you're a filthy and cap. <laughs> free of the people. I don't know a bit. Yeah. Something the basic is drinking on the other bottle branded consumer. Yeah. I hate drinking water <laughs> from bottles. <laughs> I hate it. Land should be a commodity to be bought and sold. What do you mean? Land. Strongly disagree. We have land should be a commodity. Do you mean like, is this a communist thing? Land should be a commodity to be bought and sold. No, strongly disagree. Better than many fossil fortunes made by people seemingly manipulating money and contribute nothing to society. I strongly disagree. I mean, they contribute a lot. Usually millionaires, like, make jobs for people. I mean, most of the, like, like, most of the money of millionaires is just in assets. I mean, they make, they make, like, the factories and shit for people to work in and... By people simply manipulating and dropping nothing to society. Be personal for to now, people simply manipulate money and contribute nothing to society. You mean like stockbrokers? Uh, like stockbrokers? I don't know, but they. I don't really get what that means. Usually, if you're manipulating money, you're contributing to society. I mean, if you're a stockbroker, you're investing in companies which generate jobs. I mean, yeah, I don't really get that question. Protectionism is sometimes necessary in trade. Protectionism. What is protectionism? Let's look that up. Yeah, I'd have to agree. I'll, I'll agree slightly. I mean, look at Russia. I mean, sometimes necessary in trade. I mean, if a country is evil, you want to put tariffs on it or sanction it or... Yeah. Sometimes that's a good idea. Any social responsibility of a company should be delivered a profit to its shareholders. Yeah, I'd have to agree. That usually... That usually leads to good. I mean, more jobs. I mean, giving what people want. Profit to its shareholders. Like, look at Disney. I mean... When they're not thinking... Of, they're thinking about social justice, like... Making their cast more diverse and everything, they they make shit product. 
<laughs> I mean, and kind of evil. I mean, they're destroying art for it. I mean, do the profit to its shareholders. I mean, they make more profit. Everybody makes more money. They're able to employ more people. I mean, profit to its shareholders. Yeah. I mean, and if you want them to look after the environment, you know, you get the government to step in. I. The rich are too highly taxed. I disagree. You should be slightly taxed more. I don't know. Although, uh, I don't know. So it should be sort of profit on shareholders. Which are too highly taxed? That's a tough question. Because I'm not rich, I'm not taxed. <laughs> I'm poor. So I don't know how rich people feel. I don't have to disagree. But then again, if they are highly taxed, they can create... Like, they can't create more jobs, I mean... I have to agree, I'll agree. Those with the ability to pay should have access to high standards of medical work. Nah, fuck that. As a Christian, I I strongly disagree. <laughs> the ability to pay should have access to high standards of medical care. Actually, no, oh... Yeah, no, I, I'm, I'm definitely left with medical care. I mean... Kind of. That's a... Uh, yeah. Everybody deserves to die if they get sick. Everybody deserves that. Everybody is equal. And at least in their life, anyway. Maybe not an ability. <laughs> Government should penalize businesses that mislead the public. Yeah. I mean, what is it in, like, the olden days that they, they used to have companies which sell, like, poison, like, bad products and shit. Like in the Industrial Revolution, like the Industrial Age. Was it the Industrial? Penalized businesses, yeah, they used to sell rat poison and, and disguise it as something else, I remember. And they ended up regulating the companies which did it. I don't remember when or... Well, it's got some time ago. Yeah, it's a reason why we have regulations for companies. Yeah, they should. It's agreed somewhat. I mean, we should be able to lie a little bit. I don't know. Restrictions of the ability to protect it to multinationals to create monopolies. Yeah, they do. I don't want Disney taking over the world. I don't want to... <laughs> I don't want Mickey Mouse suddenly. Those restrictions of the ability to predator to multinationals. Yeah, they need to be restricted. I don't want... I mean, I, I get that the, the bigger the company, the more chance it's going to implode and... And go down, but I don't know. I don't want to. I don't want Disney suddenly overtaking ev over everything. And what else? Yeah. I don't want to pledge allegiance to Mickey. <laughs> I'm not pleasing, no good. Abortion within life does not credit should always be illegal. Uh, no, with abortion, like it's fine if it's in the first or second or even third month, but 
I don't know. Like, it, it's fine. I mean, it's stupid to say, no, no, the fetus, the fetus is alive. No, it's not, it's a fucking fetus. <laughs> Do you remember? Do you remember when you were a fetus? <laughs> Kill the baby. <laughs> Killed the babies, I don't know. I think it's stupid. But, yeah, but, I don't know. That's a tricky question, abortion. Because, like, you don't want to go too far and have, like, an abortion in the ninth month. <laughs> On the eighth month. When the baby is fully formed. But it's fine. If they're, if they're still young... I didn't see any problem with it. Authority should be questioned, yeah. Of course it should be. Authority should be questioned. Except for God. Shouldn't question God. That's bad. Oh, wait, no, even God. <laughs> Knife for an eye and a tooth for a tooth. Nah, I strongly disagree. That's stupid. I could have a two through two cycle of violence, man. As you know, you have to de escalate stuff. Well, no, no, no. You do need to. Uh, that's tough, actually. I can disagree somewhat. Not strongly disagree. It is sometimes okay to fight back, but my friend are in a tooth or tooth. But you have to do it sparringly, I mean. You know, like You know, like Jesus said, you know, you should forgive your enemies. Taxpayers should not be expected property theatres or museums to conspire on a permanent basis. Yes, strongly agree. Holy shit. Schools should not make class attendance compulsory. Should not make class attendance compulsory. Strongly disagree. Holy crap. Why would you? <laughs> what do you mean, like? How's your intention? Compulsory. Strongly disagree. You need to go. You need to learn some discipline, kids. <laughs> All people have the right to do all this. They're doing so to be keep to their own kind. All this different sorts of people should keep to their own kind. Yeah. I somewhat agree. I mean, multiculturalism is kind of a disaster <laughs> in Australia. <laughs> and in America, you know, with the Venezuelan gangs, like, taking over hotels and the migrants. Yeah, I mean, you know, in Filipino... I'm a Filipino-Australian, but, you know, I integrate to Australian society, I mean. I speak the language, I hang out with Australians. With Filipinos and Australians, you know, yeah, you should integrate. You should keep to their own kind. I mean, if you don't have anything in common with somebody, it's like, there's more chance of you fighting with each other, disagreeing with each other. I mean, it's not good. It's not good for a country. Good parents sometimes have to spank their children. Um, nah, strongly disagree. Shouldn't need to hit children. I mean... Or to spank their children. Or to spank their children. I mean, unless they do something really bad, like, I don't know, stab somebody. <laughs> the kid stabs up at somebody. I don't know. 
Like, it is an adult. You don't go around hitting people. And you have to teach children not to hit people at an early age. Or else they're gonna, as an adult, they're going to hit people as well. They're going to act like a thug. You don't want them... You don't want them being a thug. I mean, I was hit as a kid. I'm a thug. <laughs> I grew up to be a thug. I was beating up everybody in high school and in primary school. It's no good. You shouldn't teach your kids violence. That violence might rex right. Even though I don't have kids, I don't know, maybe... I'm guessing there's other ways, you know, you should take away the Nintendo or, I don't know, Time Out or something. But you don't, you shouldn't need to spank the kid, yeah. Natural children keep some secrets to the parents, yeah, strongly degree, holy shit. Still remember my mum. Of course I'm an artist, I drew a lot of porn when I was a kid. <laughs> I was a teenager and always, always my mom always went into my room. Yeah. It's annoying. Yeah, you just don't. You, you don't go snooping through other people's rooms. It's annoying. Pressing always should not be a criminal offence. Yeah, strongly agree. I mean, you have top harder drugs. I mean, I'm anti fucking psychotics, <laughs> which are far, which is far more stronger than marijuana used to treat people. I mean, why not marijuana used to treat for pain or something? Yeah. Let's see why not. And you have alcohol. I mean, alcohol is a fairly hard drug as well. So why not parent marijuana? Like, it's not like I'm for all drugs. I, I, I disagree with people saying, Oh, you should just legalize all drugs. Which is fucking dumb. I mean, what, opium? Do you want to you wanna legalize crack or <laughs> crack cocaine, which completely destroyed the black community <laughs> in America? Or do you want to... Well, I know that alcohol is banned in Aboriginal communities because it's yeah they haven't built up a tolerance to it so yeah it's smart for them to ban it so yeah the marijuana is fine it's mild yeah prime function schooling should be quick the future generation to find jobs um I kind of disagree. I mean, prime function of schooling should be the. I don't know. Do a future generation to find jobs. Somewhat disagree. Should be the. Just generally getting along with people. I don't know. Um, maybe I agree. I agree. I don't know. I don't know. Serious inheritable disability should not be allowed to reproduce by retardation. Yeah, I'd have to agree. Inheritable disability. How to reproduce? Yeah, if you're retarded, I don't know. Mentally retarded. Yeah, they, they shouldn't reproduce. It's mean, but yeah. You don't want to put that on your kids. Important thing for children to learn is to accept discipline. Important thing for children to learn is to accept discipline. I think the most important thing for children to learn is. I don't know, how to be independent. And not to rely on their parents for everything. Yeah, not be a... What is it? A, not for the parent to be a helicopter parent and not... 
not always constantly check on them and yeah to learn how to do stuff like I don't know clean their room and stuff except discipline what do they mean by discipline they mean like except discipline yeah, I have to disagree. disagree. Savage and civilized people, they're only different cultures. I disagree. <laughs> Savage and civilized people, they're only different cultures. I have to disagree. I mean, come on, like. Uh, cultures like people in the Congo where they're raping women <laughs> come on <laughs> those are savages <laughs> same with not to be mean to Muslims but you know I mean putting homosexuals having a law putting homosexuals to death is a bit much as well only different cultures, savage and civilized people, only different cultures. Oh, yeah, I'd have to disagree. So, we're able to work and defeat someone you should not expect society support. Yeah, I have to agree. I mean, that's a good question. Because, like, Is it able to work in views who not expect society's support? I don't know if I strongly agree with that, because, like... Like, I feel like... I'm, I'm just, I suppose that's referring to the unemployment benefits. Because, like, I feel like there should be unemployment benefits, but... It should be low enough for them to have a miserable life. To get them to actually want to work. <laughs> To get better stuff. But not high enough to. I don't know. Make them go on hinge like the. Oh god. I'm, I'm <laughs> saying one of the spicy things. But. Like with the. Look don't bully me. <laughs> but the, the aboriginal communities. Like they have. Not like I hate Aboriginals, I like Aboriginal people, they're, they're fun people to hang around, but, you know, Aboriginals, a lot of Aboriginals admit that because they get benefits, they get a special benefit for being Aboriginal or Torres Strait Islander or whatever, like they don't have any reason to work. <laughs> So they spend all their unemployment benefits on alcohol and everything and or drugs and yeah, they go nuts. <laughs> so it's not good and I think this is the same with American Indians, isn't it? Native Americans, that's it. Yeah, that you need to you can't have benefits as so high that you don't have an incentive to work because, yeah, people spend, will spend their benefits if they don't have anything to occupy their time. They'll spend it on, yeah, they spend it on alcohol and bad stuff. Yeah, try not to think about it. Keep busy and watch. Oh, hell no. Better not to think about it. Strongly disagree. You need to think about it. That's a problem. That's why we have such a big problem with depression and everything. Because people want to... Uh, uh, people avoid thinking about it. People avoid thinking things through. And they feel sad. And no, they'd rather take drugs. They'd rather numb the pain. And not, you know... Learn from the pain. It's not good. I used to... You know, I used to be like that. I used to think, oh no, you have to be positive. You have to think cheerful things. But when the house is on fire, you know, you, you get a water bucket. You get to work. You don't just 
be like that dog <laughs> in the in the KC Green comment can just say this is fine. You know, you, you, it's time to panic. When you're panicking, you, you do something about it. You don't... You have to think it through. I, I hate that. I hate that positive thought shit. First generation immigrants semi fully grown in the country. I strongly disagree. I did. I'm... Immigrants are fine if they integrate and there's not too many of them. And if they, they're not illegal. Of course they can fully integrate within a new country. Of course they can. It's culture. We're not like different species or whatever. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's culture. It's cultures which determine who you are. Well, there's other stuff, but. You know, culture is a big thing. It's not genetics or anything. And, yeah, as long as you... Yeah, first generation of immigrants. That's like okay. That annoys me. What's good for the most successful corporations? Always ultimately good for all of us. Uh, yeah, I have to agree. Again, they make jobs, we get money from them, they keep the economy running. Burberry has the interest, how many pins come to be paid? Um, I like the ABC, uh, actually do I like the ABC? I know Triple J is bullshit, <laughs> I hate Triple J, <laughs> but I don't know, uh, Good aiming independent. Our independent content. Uh, I have to disagree. I'll disagree. I like the ABC. I like SBS. They're cool. Civil liberties are curbed in the name of counter terrorism. Yeah. Yeah, terrorism. Just to be curved, yeah, I have to strongly agree. I mean, terrorism just doesn't do that much. <laughs> Not even, like, mass shootings. I know, hot take. But mass shootings are only, like, just a tiny percentage of people. I mean, not many people die in a mass shooting. <laughs> at least compared to the the holes of like a the whole of the humanity I mean there's a very tiny percentage of people and yet we go nuts over it we go you know the logical thing would be is not to have all them is just to completely ignore it and maybe make it legal for them to for news organizations to to report on it, I don't know. Like that's the whole point of terrorism is to make you shit your pants and to react to them. Yeah. Which of one party says avoid all arguments. I strongly disagree. That sounds like communism. Party state avoid all arguments and delay progress in the democratic political system. One party state. I don't know, it's official, so it's easy. Only wrong leaders need to be worried. Oh, hell no. Because, like, it also makes, because, like, how about if they're wrongdoers on the other end of the surveillance cameras, though? 
I mean, wrongdoers are everywhere. Wrongdoers are in our governments. Wrongdoers are... Yeah. And they could be using the cameras to... Cut down on dissidents, like, um... Yeah. Official surveillance. Yeah, I mean... Yeah. Death penalty should up to most serious crimes. Nah, I strongly disagree. I mean... Think about the death penalty. What happens when you die? I mean, you don't know what happens when you die. It seems to be unfair. It... I mean, it could be really nice when you die. I mean, why would you kill them when we don't know? I mean, what if there's no hell? <laughs> I mean, as a Christian, I mean, I believe that there's a hell, but... I mean, I might as well make it... Make them live for as long as possible to leave them miserable. <laughs> make them as miserable as, as long as possible. Because, like, death could be a release for them. I don't know. I don't think that's good. And also, there's also the point that also they could be innocent. You never really know that. And also, because, like, unless you get caught on camera, there's not really a sure way of knowing whether they did the thing or not. And also, apparently, the death penalty is really expensive. Because you have to keep them in jail. You keep them isolated in jail for a long time. And the drugs are really expensive. Like, lethal injections are apparently very expensive to to do. Is people don't like shoot shootings or anything, or hanging, because they like it all nice and clean. Electrical, yeah. No, I disagree. It's stupid. Death penalty, stupid. You shouldn't kill. You shouldn't kill, because again, you don't know what happens when you die. This again could be nice. Could be really good for them. Could be a release. I don't agree. They should pay for their crime in jail. I don't care. I'll pay. I'll pay to make them pay. So <laughs> by society, one's always have your blood be obeyed and people below to be... <sighs> yeah, I have to agree somewhat. Do we obey them? I mean, we're hierarchical creatures. I mean... So as those people, people above to be obeyed, I mean, people above tend on all the laws and shit and all the hard stuff, well, we can just hang out and just work. I mean, not everybody wants to be a ruler. <laughs> I mean, you don't always, yeah. Let's always have people above to bed, people below to be commanded. Yeah, I'd have to strongly agree, actually. Abstract art. In the society, people below to be commanded. Yeah. Abstract art that doesn't represent anything shouldn't be considered art at all. How abstract? Yeah, I have to agree. I hate it. What do you mean, like, <laughs> I've seen, like, art pieces which are like just a painted on canvas like they just paint the canvas completely black <laughs> i've seen stupid shit oh they have the, the that stupid abstract art which is just a square on top of another square <laughs> it's just it's so dumb yeah come on you gotta put some effort in your art oh ooh, some squiggles you just draw some squiggles on a on a on a on a, uh, on a canvas, <laughs> some rainbow squiggles, wow, oh, he's so amazing, so talented, so talented, it's like <laughs> complimenting a child, 
It's abstract. Oh, goddamn abstract art. I hate it. Google Justice. So it should be more important. Yeah, I'd have to agree. I mean, if they just get rehabilitation. I mean, of course, rehabilitation and forgiveness is important, but they need the punishment. They need to have the stick to prevent them from going to jail or else. Yeah, it's dumb. Be like in America, they're all releasing all the prisoners. <laughs> Waste time to try to rehabilitate some criminals. Nah, strongly disagree. Even serial killers, even serial killers, even though I think that serial killers should be locked up for life, they should all have a chance to rehabilitate. Strongly disagree. Everybody always deserves a second chance. Doesn't mean I don't believe in the life in prison course like with serial killers like Ted Bundy then again he still deserves to do some good in his world in the world yeah everybody deserves a right to be redeemed yeah. is the most of manufacturing more important than the writers and the artists hmm yeah I'd have to agree I'd have to agree because like well that doesn't mean it's all the time but I mean you get food from them you get all the wants of the needs from them you get food you get oh no you also get wants from them. you also get movies and shit from them as well you also get all the TVs and stuff to watch stuff which writer and artists are made. Yeah, I'd have to agree. Even though I am an artist, but... Mm. Models may have careers, but their first duty is to be homemakers. <sighs> what do you mean by homemaker? I'd have to agree somewhat. I mean, you're a mom. You should... You should look after your kids. Oh, wait, no, but then again, look... Look, the kid fends for themselves as good as well. I mean... They, those kids better learn to clean their rooms. <laughs> yeah, I'd have to disagree. Also, Paul Minister, one of the second old gravity shoes, he's the one that comes in. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Promise economic growth. I mean, if we have economic growth, then we have more money. And if we have more money, that growth is. then we'll be able to have more money and stuff to curb global warming I don't know somewhat disagree I, d I disagree make a piece of establishable and aspect of maturity yeah somewhat agree establish but some the I mean governments aren't that bad some of them being a bit too big. But. I mean. You had a lot of good stuff out. I don't know how to explain it. Anyway. I'm... <laughs> well, this is a shit video. <laughs> Astrology actually explains many things. No. No, not astrology. No, cannot be moral without being religious. Agree. Yeah, I agree. Not strongly agree. I mean, it's like it's tougher though. I mean, being brainwashed from an early age 
I can hear a lot of people nowadays don't even believe in good and evil. They think, oh no, they're just two sides. Different sides of different perspectives. It's, no. What is a baby rape? Not evil. <laughs> is murder not evil? Murder of the elderly? Like, not in war or anything, but it's murder, like, Bashing somebody's head in with a rock. <laughs> or bashing a cat's head in with a rock. Evil. <laughs> I mean, not evil. You know. I don't know where I'm going with this, but... That being religious, yeah. I mean... God, I don't explain things right now. I mean, moral about being religious. Yeah, I agree. I mean, you need... I mean, look at the world today. Instant religion died with the atheists. Atheism suddenly began to rise and... Yeah. Now everybody's some immoral. I mean, yeah, I don't know how to explain. Charity is better than social security. It means a whole thing generally. Nah, I disagree. What are the generally disadvantaged charity? Charities, charities like. It's not very sure, though. I mean, sometimes... Yeah, charity leads to a lot of corruption as well. Because, like... Sometimes you can get more than what you actually need to help somebody. And then, ooh, the guy could cut, get cut off... Cut off the money from the top and take it for himself. <laughs> like the charity goers. Yeah, I don't trust charities. Like them, them child, oh, what's it called? I don't remember. Yeah, charity's uh, kind of evil. Social security, yeah. I think that should be, that should be left to the government. I want to be in control of where the money goes. Yeah, charity has a lot of corruption, I don't some people are naturally unlucky. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> I agree, I mean. Naturally unlucky. Put my child's school instills religious values. Yeah, strongly agree. Again, religious values are important. People go nuts with that. I mean, that religion... You know... It's a good way of brainwashing people, really. Religion is, you know, forgiving people and like teaching people to forgive people and like what else? Not to judge people when you have like a log in your eye <laughs> or they have a speck. Yeah, it's a, it's a good way to brainwash kids into being good people. Yeah. This is values, unless it's against gay people, I mean, obviously gay people, gay people and Christianity, I mean, there's nothing wrong with being gay, I mean, it's kind of dumb how they keep fighting it, <laughs> they should just admit that they're wrong. Aside from transgender people, I mean, no offence to transgender, anybody who's transgender watching this, I mean, <laughs> I mean, it's just, what am I, where am I going with this? It's just that, you know, I'm not for transgenders in sports. I mean, obviously that's stupid. And I think that it's kind of a social contagion, especially with women 
transitioning into men. It's apparently a social contagion, like there's many, a lot of transitioners, which are detransitioning. Yeah. Men and women apparently are very happy, though. I don't know, where, where am I going with this? I don't know. Well, child school instills religious vows, yeah. I have to agree. Sex and sad marriage is usually immoral. <sighs> disagree. I wouldn't say strongly disagree, but... Just sleeping around, though, is pretty bad. Like, just sleeping around with a ton of people. Having a high body count. It's not a good idea. I mean, it means it. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why that's a bad idea, but I can't really explain it. God damn, I suck at this. Sex aside, marriage. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with sleeping around a bit and seeing if you're sexually compatible. I mean, I mean, you want to know everything about this person you want to marry. I mean, why not have sex with them as well? Because, like, if the sex is bad, then... Well, the marriage is probably going to be bad as well. So you might as well, you know, have sex with them to see if you're compatible. And, yeah. Usually more, but then again, yeah, going in the complete opposite direction... Having sex just for sex sake, it's kind of lame. I mean, people are not going to trust you if you they find out that you have sex so much. And of course, we're creatures of habit as well. I mean, if you sleep around a lot and you want a relationship, then there's a higher chance of you sleeping with somebody else because you, you're so used to doing it. Like, you. There's a chance of you cheating because you're used to sleeping around so much. Anyway, damn, so I want to stay with me. Should not be excluded from possibility of child stuff. Yeah, I strongly agree. Nothing wrong with them. So, I'm going really sure to read child adoption. Consider it to be legal for the adult. Yeah, I agree. Consenting adults should be illegal. Pornography depicting stenting adults should be legal for the adult population. Yeah, it's nothing wrong with porn. I hate all this. You know, everybody suddenly turned on porn. Legal. At the very least, should be legal because, like, ooh. even though they they say, "Ooh." Pornography is the new drug, but dude, we have other drugs. <laughs> we have other drugs which are legal. Like with alcohol, I mean, people are allowed to drink alcohol, even though it's obviously harmful to us, so why not pornography? I mean, we have, we consume illegal, like bad substances all the time, which are bad for us. Yeah, stay. Yeah. Going too far. Going too far if you make it illegal. Yeah. Pornography. I think it's fine. Pornography's fine. As long as the, the women aren't being, like, taken advantage of. It's the only thing which I'm... Which I kind of agree with. With the anti-porn side, but... Yeah. I don't know, I'm rambling. What goes on probably dreams on sending adults is no business in the state. Yeah, I strongly agree. No one can feel naturally homosexual. <laughs> strongly disagree. Some people are just real gay. I mean, really gay. <laughs> like... Yeah, I can think of several people who are like, dude, you gay. You you are born gay. Is that open of sex has gone to Yeah, I strongly agree. 
Made special with courses. The Pride events. The gay Pride events would like them all getting naked in front of children. On the drag queens reading to little kids and everybody talking about transgender transitioning and young kids and I don't know. Let's see where you stand. Oh, I'm libertarian, right? No, no, I'm left. No, I'm left. What have I become? No, I moved. I used to be around here. Actually, I used to be fairly far left. Oh. Economic left, right. <laughs> libertarian. So I'm a, libi I'm a filthy libertarian. No. <laughs> I don't want to be libertarian. <laughs> I don't want to be a libertarian. Don't step on snick. <laughs> don't step on snick. I don't know. This is kind of a disaster video. I don't know how to explain myself. I don't know how to explain things very well. We'll save it. Wow, well, I'm libertarian, right? I never knew. I never knew. And yet I vote Labour. <laughs> Why? <laughs> no, I've moved. <laughs> I've moved. <laughs> Holy shit. Well, I guess that's a video. Yeah, just experimenting. Just been experimenting with different videos. I mean, I don't know how well I did explaining my positions on stuff. So like, yeah, I'm libertarian, right? I'm a libertarian now. My mind is blown. Yeah, it's probably all the... Oh, it's Nita Sarkeesian, isn't it? There's Gamergate, there's Trump, everybody lying about Trump. There's, yeah, all this stuff as well, the transgender. Transgenders, having the pronouns and the, and the, not even, the left not even understanding how to, not even saying what a woman is and yeah no oh, I'm libertarian I never knew I hate libertarians <laughs> they get gonna hate libertarian I'm right now I'm surprised Well, anyway, I guess that's a video. I mean, yeah. I don't know what else to say. Maybe I'll vote for ScoMo. <laughs> I'll vote Liberal next. <laughs> vote Liberal next election. I'm Australian, I mean. 
you know, you know, I'm Australian. Uh, it's liberal means right. In case you don't know. Anyway, I'll see you guys later.